that I wanted to compare the charts from 100 years ago. I wanted to know exactly what happened from 1919 to 2000, uh, 1929 before the Great Great Depression. And this is a chart that I found and look inter how interesting it is. And I found out this chart to be fascinating. You know, if you go back 100 years ago, look what happened. You look at about 2019 here, guys. And look here at the double top. There was a double top. There was a drop in the market, right? Of about, they went about from 1500 to 900 there. So uh, about 35% drop from the top. And then look what happened. And that would be like around the elections too, uh, if you look now. And then boom. Then there was a 10 years, 9 years, incredible uh, uh, rally, incredible expansion. So I really want to press upon you, you know, uh, a way to think well differently. Why not look at the charts from then, you know, 100 years ago? It's pretty cool to kind of have an idea here because that would tell you. So if we go a little more granular, you see that the March to July 1919 was a problem. And then it started topping minus 35% and then this incredible rebound after July 2021. So that confirms two things then. That was about the two years recession or that was the two-year drop and then incredible rebound so i don't know if this is going to be the case scenario but i want to press upon you that it is an interesting chart to look for to see the parallel of the stock market crash and the recession of 1919 to 1921 and then the rebound until 1929 when we got the Great Depression. I think it's an interesting parallel to look at and we are going to look at also other charts, the 2001 drop and the 2008 drop, but I thought it was really cool to look at this.